Okay, in this short video, I'm going to take a quick look at comparing the performance of my MP1 vertical antenna that I use for portable operations in POTA an awful lot, configured with the four supplied ground radials. And this is how I've been deploying this antenna uh, for many years. I want to compare the performance just in terms of the SWR and the match when using these ground radials versus using the magic carpet, this uh, conductive fabric. So we'll just take a couple of SWR sweeps on the four bands that I typically use and we'll compare the results. Okay, so the magic carpet configuration is just laid out here on the grass. And just to be sure I've got a good ground connection because uh, my legs have got uh, little rubber feet on them. I connected up this uh, little ground lead uh, to connect up to the fabric. Did a quick sweep actually before this and it didn't make a difference, but we're going to do it uh, this time just to be sure. All right, so starting off on 17 meters, this is the plot of SWR using my four radials. And we can see that it's basically about uh, 1.3 to about 1.36 across the frequency range. So now we'll add the red trace here. The red trace is the result with the magic carpet. And we can see that's, uh, we select that. So that's running about 1.08 to about 1.1. So certainly the magic carpet gives us an improvement here on 17 meters. Let's look at some of the other bands. So now here's the 20 meter band using the kind of predefined stops I have my, on my little tuning aid. So not perfectly optimized, but we're going to leave everything the same for making these two measurements. So this is now the 20 meter band using my four radials. And we can see that at the low end of the band, it's about 1.13. And up at the high end of the band, it's about 1.54. So certainly usable across the entire 20 meter band. Let's add the magic carpet results. So we can see now the magic carpet results here actually just slightly worse but really not that bad right it's still about 1.25 1.26 at the low end of the band 1.65 at the high end of the band uh, just slightly worse than um, the uh, radials but certainly still quite acceptable so 20 meters works pretty well with this magic carpet here's the performance on 30 meters uh, again this is with my four radials and we can see about 1.2 uh, to 1.3 across the board on the 30 meter band. And now the results with the magic carpet, again, everything else being identical, there's the magic carpet results here, the green line. And we can see we're at about 1.8 uh, or so across the board. So really not quite as good as my four uh, 10 foot radials. So uh, magic carpet is not doing as well here. And finally, let's take a quick look at 40 meters where I spend most of my time when operating POTA. And here's uh, my result uh, with my four 10-foot radials. And we can see that uh, down on the CW portion of the band, we're typically below 1.5 to 1 for the most part, except at the very bottom of the band here. And certainly even well below uh, 1.65 or so to 1 across the entire 40-meter band. So uh, quite acceptable. Let's add the magic carpet results. So here's the results with the radials replaced with the magic carpet. Uh, we can see that we're still below 1.8 to 1 on essentially the CW portion of the band, but the phone portion of the band uh, certainly goes all the way well over 3 to 1 at the top end of the band, so it's not nearly as good. And I guess we can kind of expect that, that the, uh, the area of that magic carpet just isn't large enough to get enough ground coupling to get uh, a good ground plane here on 40 meters. Well, as you can see from my very unscientific, very quick tests, the results are a little bit of a mixed bag. Uh, 20 meters, uh, 17 meters looked a little bit better, but 30 and 40 looked a little bit worse. So I don't know, I might just stick with my ground radials. I can uh, put them out pretty quickly. I don't have to worry about the wind blowing them away. Anyway, thought you might find this uh, video a little bit interesting and make your own conclusions about what to do with the magic carpet for a portable vertical antenna. Thanks again for watching.